I am 4123 Joe. Welcome live in New York City. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the Intercontinental Championship. Making his way to the ring from Dublin, Ireland, weighing 267 pounds, he is the Intercontinental Champion, the Celtic Warrior, Shema. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. What a way to start the pay-per-view with the Intercontinental Championship on the line in a false count anywhere match. A great way to start the TLC pay-per-view live in New York City, New York, in Madison Square Garden. Daniel Bryan being bothered by the WWE fans as he chants no they chant yes and they chant yes even louder every time he chants no but besides that ladies and gentlemen Daniel Bryan has worked his way up to this point here tonight Daniel Bryan has won a battle royal weeks ago on Monday Night Raw on his own he earned the title shot on his own. He beat the, he pinned, look, he made the champion submit on Monday Night Raw two weeks ago. And now tonight might be his night. Can he become Intercontinental Champion? Or Sheamus retain the title once again? Let's get this match out of the way. False count anywhere. Remember, the WWE Intercontinental Heavyweight Championship is on the line. A prestigious title. First held by the Hall of Famer, Pat Patterson. And now tonight, Sheamus versus Daniel Bryan. Who's going to walk out in New York City? Heading into the Royal Rumble pay-per-view as Intercontinental Champion. This match is underway. As Sheamus. Oh, Daniel Bryan has him in the headlock. And now, Iron Stripping. Daniel and Daniel with the DDT counter. Daniel Bryan has worked his way up all the way up to this point. He needs to beat the Intercontinental Champion. He needs to be Intercontinental Champion to prove why he deserves. To be a champion of WWE without the fans' help. And Sheamus for the better the better draw. And a tough to wall slam by Sheamus. And Daniel Bryan with a running elbow. Sheamus with a counter. Sheamus has been a terrific intercontinental champion lately. After defeating Rusev at the in the Fatal Four Way match at the Hell in the Cell pay per view, after after winning that Fatal Four Way match, you know Sheamus has retained the title ever since. He's been a good champion. He's been a fighting champion. Oh, Daniel Bryan bringing out the bat, shape of Sting, and Daniel. Oh, Daniel Bryan was gonna go for a kick to distract Sheamus. But Sheamus using the bat to his advantage, knocking Daniel Bryan down. Shots to the head, shots to the back. Daniel Bryan put a flip out neck breaker. Daniel Bryan brought out a weapon and then it paid for it. Oh, he's gonna do it again. All right, now he brought out a steel chair. This time he's into advantage. Daniel Bryan, chop. Chair, chair shots to the back of Sheamus. Chair, chair shots to the to the skull. Jeez, what a way to start the pay-per-view. And now Sheamus. Oh my God, no! 
Oh my god, no. Not on the announce table. Not on the announce table! Oh! Oh. Okay. But Sheamus! High cross! Will you do it? And it's over. Sheamus has beaten Daniel Bryan. And still the Intercontinental Champion, the Celtic Warrior, Sheamus. I think Sheamus has beaten Daniel Bryan in record fashion. I mean, how long was that? One minute? Two minutes? Very disappointing for Daniel Bryan and for the Daniel Bryan fans, I guess, if there's any in this arena. Well, anyway, Sheamus has retained the Intercontinental Championship once again. Here we go. On to our next match already. The U.S. Championship is on the line. The following contest is a tables match. The only way to win this bout is to place your opponent through a table. Is for the United States Championship. Making his way to the ring from San Diego, California, weighing 175 pounds, he is the United States Champion, Ray Mysterio. So, oh, it's a tables match, eh? All right. Let's see how that's going to play out for Ray Mysterio and the Miz. U.S. title on the line with the master of the 619. Rey Mysterio looking ready to defend his belt. Can he keep it? Will he retain it here tonight? Awesome. Will Rey Mysterio retain the title or will the... New champion be awesome. Well, the Miz win is, I am, I'm assuming, third United States Championship. But first in his universe role, in this universe role. Miz looks ready. Who's going to walk out? U.S. champ. The United States Championship will be on the line in this historic tables match. Here we go. Tables match. Miz, Rey Mysterio. And Rey Mysterio with a DDT. And Miz trying to strike and Rey Mysterio with a counter. Rey Mysterio has done it all. Former World Heavyweight Champion, two time. Former WWE Champion, former Tag Team Champion, World Tag Team Champion, and now current US Champion, former Intercontinental Champion. I mean, Rey Mysterio has done it all in the WWE. And on the Miz, with a flip out neckbreaker. Miz. Look at the and Miz's career. The Reality Randy superstar. The final Rey odds that Known from M MTV. How he did it. It was absolutely amazing. Oh, no. Former oh. tag team champion. World tag team champion. A quick kick by Mysterio. Former Intercontinental champion. Former abuse. United States United champion. So far, but remember, we have that tremendous main event still to come. And Ray with a counter and former WWE Champion The Miz. And now Ray Mysterio, Miz with a counter. And now Miz going for a suplex. Oh, Ray Mysterio counters. And Ray with a counter again with the arm drag. Ray Mysterio with a double drop. He's having a seriously hard time getting back to his feet after that. Now Ray Mysterio trying to get what the table. Devastation will we see now? I don't know. But Miz beats oh, him all time. As Miz oh, takes the table from Ray. Bringing the table in the ring. And the table. The table's like, no, I'm not getting to that collision. And then left somehow. 
Mysterio now Rey Mysterio already with the kick in the mix session to the face. Now what we're gonna go for here. Already, look at this, Rey Mysterio. You gotta be kidding me. Six, one, nine. Remember, there's no pinfall, no submissions in this matchup. Rey has to put Miz to the table. There's no disqualification, there's also no countouts. The only way to win is to put your opponent through a table. That tank of his has to be reading empty. It has to be King, but I still don't see him giving up. Wait a minute. Looks now, Miz like taking the table, the preventing Ray Mysterio from getting That's any ideas. Ray Mysterio at the table now. Gonna use the table and knock down Miz. The Miz. And now, Ray Mysterio uses the table. What's Raymond still thinking here? What's he gonna do here? Waiting for Miz to get up? Oh. I think he has an idea. And now Miz realizing. And Raymond still wanna drop it to the back. As Miz. Oh, what a counter. Russian leg sweep. I told you I upload this on Sunday, July 12, which is today. But Monday Night Raw might not come for a while. As I'm looking for a job still. Just letting y'all know that little update. As Rey Mysterio attacking the leg and the table. It's not in position how it was put earlier. Now Rey Mysterio thinking, where should he put the table? And he decided to put it right there instead of putting it in the corner because normally they'll put normally in a tables match They'll put it in the corner as Raymond Stereo sets the Miz up Try to wear the Miz down on that table Raymond Stereo Raymond Stereo might retain the US title Raymond Stereo go for a splash. Oh Somehow was able to get up as Miz with a counter swinging neckbreaker Miz has been in a table smash before. He defeated. He oh, and Rip was terrible to counter. He defeated Randy Orton at the table smash before. That's Miz. Counter that counters. Now, Miz, Iris shifting Ray into the corner. Hard whip into the corner. As Miz, Norman Mysterio, counter with a Russian leg sweep. He's back on his feet. But you can see the abuse from this. Miz reverses the elbow. Miz throwing all cylinders in this match and Rey Mysterio with a counter and now Rey again kicked in the mix session and a kick to the skull of Miz now it's Rey gonna go for here don't tell him he's gonna go for the 619 again oh, no Miz realizing they order for Ray to set up the 619 Miz with a kick to the to the legs. Miz realizing how Ray Mysterio sets up the 619. Goes for the the Frankensteiner onto the ropes. And now Miz with a suplex connects. But remember, this is a tables match. We haven't seen a table in a while so far. Back party drop. Okay, Miz realizing he has to get a table. Things are about to get ugly. And he's heading back How was, inside the uh, ring. Is the announce what table does the announce table count? I don't know. I don't know, but I think we're about to find out. Miz try to get a little extreme here. Miz try to get a little woody. Remember, there are no count Try to get more match tables. Match but Ray Mysterio counters. I mean, Miz counters actually, and now Rey Mysterio counters as Miz brings Rey Mysterio back into the ring, choking the life out of the mask of the mask man, Rey Mysterio. Oh, as Rey Mysterio dodges 
the attempted attack from Miz by kicking him into the side of the leg. Miz. Miz! Oh, I thought he was going to go for a wrestle next week onto the corner. Now it's Miz going to go for here. Miz. Oh, Ray Mysterio with a counter. Now it's really going to go for here. Ray Mysterio counters for the Hurricanrana. Miz is going to go for a maneuver, but Ray Mysterio can't counter it. Now it's really going to go for it again. Ray just playing with the Miz so far. He's got him hooked. Now it's really going to go for here. Trying to wear down the Miz. That's Ray Mysterio going up. Oh my god. Ray Mysterio is going to go for a drop kick. It wasn't that much creative, but I mean, then again, we never saw a drop kick through a table, but it didn't work out for Ray. And our Miz counters. And our Miz Scarcrest finale, but he needs to do that on the table. If you can do the Scarcrest finale on the table, that'll win him the United States title. Let's go for a DDT. Where counters? Ray Mysterio going for the six. One. Nine. Drop the dime. Yeah, he needs the table. Elbow drop. I understand. They got to wear down their opponent before they can put them through a table. But. I mean, come on now. At least have a table in the ring so you can set it up for it, you know? Ray. Ray with counter. What a counter. Miz punching the table, hitting Ray. Now Miz is going to go for a maneuver. Ray Mysterio, here we go again. Oh god, here we go. Ray Mysterio once again. 619. Dropping the dime. But now he has to set up the table. What an exhausting matchup to call. I mean, whew. recording this live 10.04 a.m. That was Miz going to go for here. Or Mysterio. Oh, okay. Someone has to go through a table. Now Ray Mysterio going for a maneuver. Didn't put Miz through the table yet. Ray just playing around with Ray with uh, Miz. Now Miz, no oh, Miz, go for a, a count, a move, but Ray counters. Again, Ray was still just playing with Miz, it's like as Miz is all wobbly. And now Miz, this man's gonna go. Oh my God, Miz. Miz, 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 Miz! Oh! The Miz has done it! We have a new United States Champion! Here is your winner, and the new United States Champion, The Miz! The awesome one! The man born raised from Cleveland, Ohio has finally done it! Winning some championship gold in this universe mode. The Miz 
has finally win the United States Championship. I guess the champion will be awesome. Next up, our Divas match. Brie Bella, the champion set to fight the challenger as Brie defends her Divas Championship against AJ Lee. This woman is a little... She's a little rat if I would say. She sneaked her way in into this match. If you watched Monday Night Raw two or three weeks ago, AJ Lee was in a triple threat match against Tamina and Naomi. Naomi hit the super kick and AJ from behind covered Naomi and won in winning this match. Basically making her number one contender and here she is today fighting Brie Bella for the title. It worked! So I'm just saying. The way she did it. Well, anyways, AJ versus Bree. Will AJ win the Divas title? Or will Bree retain it? The WWE Divas Championship is on the line. Here we go. Here we go. AJ, Bree. Now, AJ has Bree by the waist. Can Bree counter? Oh, no, AJ got her. Headlock. Now Bree has her in the headlock. Here we go. And now Bree. Can Bree retain the title? I mean, her sister this past Thursday night on SmackDown. Nikki has won the WWE Women's Championship. Struggling for control. From Summer A. Can Bree retain it so the Bella Twins be running the WWE Divas Division? And now Brie has the arm, wrenching the arm. And I want to give a special thanks to everybody who, who watched uh, the Survivor Series pay-per-view last month. From Brie Bella. You know, it's important to point out that Brie Bella has all and now AJ, the right what a and bulldog on to Brie. I mean, the video got 200 plus views. And that New Day video I, may, I uh, recorded, I want to thank you guys for watching that too. Over 200, I think it's 235 views. I'm not sure. And that's AJ with a counter. I just want you guys to keep that up, please. Help this video grow. As I'm trying to get a job, I will make you this YouTube channel better. As Bree with a drop kick, knocking AJ down. Now AJ with a counter, a backbreaker into a neckbreaker. And AJ with a counter. What a freaking Steiner. And a Bree with a DDT. The Divas have been putting up a lot of good matches on my universe phone. Now what's AJ gonna go for here? AJ going for that bulldog. And Bree comes up with a vicious counter. Now Brie Bella wants to win just so she can join her sisters as champions. As a champion on her oh, no. brand on AJ Monday Night Raw. Nikki's the champion of SmackDown for the Divas Division. But like I said, I once said it once and I'll say it again. When WWE 2K16 drops on October 27th, it will actually, the first week will not be universe mode. The second week will, I'll be doing the story mode first. Unless, I, unless they have the, that un unlock everything uh, add-on, then yeah, sure. 
I'll get that. As Bree with the Bella Buster. And now Bree going for submission hold. I don't know why. AJ. Counter. Now is he going to go for here? Ooh, just attacking the head. Now attacking the leg of Bree. And has Brie Bella. No, the light suplex cover. Does she have her? Does she have her in the kick out of two? What a counter by AJ. Now AJ go for her, Karana. You know, AJ, what a maneuver! What a maneuver by AJ! What I wanted the championship! Cover! Oh, the kick out of two! By a by Bree! What a fighting champion! The fighting champion Bree! Won't give up the title that easy! Oh, and that paintbrush by Bree! Elbow oh, to the chest. Rush the leg sweep. Counter. I mean combo. And now Bree with a leg drop. Can Bree retain the title? Leg drop. Cover. Does he have her? And a kick out of two by AJ. I told you the Divas has been putting up a lot of great matches lately. As Bree. Snapmare drop kick. Massive damage to the skull of AJ. Now to the cover. Does he have her? Drop kick and a kick out of two. And again, Bree with the snap mirror. Going for a drop kick. There we go. And Bree with a DDT onto AJ. As Bree again, snap mirror truck kick. It's effective, but is it what? Oh wait, Bree with a single leg Boston Crab. Will AJ tap out? Will AJ tap out? Bree wrenching the leg and the back of AJ. Just a dominating display. Yeah. I think we could see a lot of I think Breeze is just to, to just to wrench it as Bree again with the battle buster. Cover hooks the leg. Will it be? Can it be? And it is. Bree Bella after a tremendous fight. Bree put a hell of a fight. AJ put up a hell of a fight. But at the end of the day, Bree Bella will retain the Divas title. Now Bree Bella can join her sister as a champion in the WWE. What a TLC pay-per-view so far it is. And this is only our, our third match. We still got four more to go. Coming up next. A World Tag Team Championship Elimination Tag Team Match. The New Day, Kofi Kingston and Big E versus Kane and the Big Show. Members of the Authority. Who's going to walk out? TLC. The final encounter between these two teams. Who's going to walk out? TLC out of New York City. In the Madison Square Garden. As World Tag Team Champions. Kane, Big Show, held on to the titles for the past couple of months now. Will they walk out in New York 
as tag team champs heading into the Royal Rumble or not. Introducing the challengers first from Tampa, Florida, weighing 285 pounds, Big E. Oh man, two of the most exciting superstars in the WWE, and the title is on the line. Big E Langston looks like he's ready. Biggie likes it and Kofi Kingston were so close on winning the World Tag Team title last month at Survivor Series. But tonight, tonight's a different story. Now, it's elimination tag team. It's not no normal tag team. Now, it's an elimination style. Meaning, if Big, for example, Big Show pins Big E, Big E's eliminated, Kofi's all alone, and Big Show can't have an advantage. Here comes Kofi Kingston. And his tag team partner from Ghana West Africa. Weight 212 pounds. Kofi Kingston. And if you want to know I guess Big Game and Kofi wanted to come out by their own music, I guess, because Well It is what it is. But I don't think that's what they're focusing on right now. They're focusing on those tag titles. Kofi Kingston and Big E, will they become World Tag Team Champs? The World Tag Team titles are on the line. Two teams want the title so bad. Kofi Kingston and Big E have a chance to win their first tag team titles as a tag team. But will Kane and Big Show not make that happen? We're going to find out right now. Let's get this match on the way. And Kane and Big E going at it. Kane. Not going to start with the small stuff. We're just going to drop it all out right there. As Kane go for a backbreaker. And then another one right now. Kane and Big E. Going at it. Um, go for a shot to the skull. But Kane blocked it into a DDT. Okay, we all have complicated relationships. Can again going for a backbreaker. When it comes to Kane, there can't be a more bizarre, tumultuous link between siblings than there is between him and his half brother, the Undertaker. Oh man, you're right. Talk Big E bringing Kane to the corner, but Kane got out nails. of the corner immediately. Again, you know, I think Kane tried to work the back of Big E. So when Big Show goes for a choke slam, or Kane goes for a choke slam, he could win the match. He could get Big E eliminated. Big E. Kane separated Big E from him and now make the tag the Big Show. Big Show and Kofi, the last two men that was in the, the tag team match in the Survivor Series World Tag Team title match last month. As Big Show, Big Show a what a power here. slam onto Kofi. Yeah, it was Big Show Kane that pinned Kofi Kingston at the Survivor the Series in the tag team the match the for the World Tag Team titles. To say the least, but those few times when they worked together, the big red monster and the dead man. Kofi Kingston had a chance to uh, win a single, win it, win a uh, a battle royale to come here tonight, being Daniel Bryan's position, minus the losing part, uh, facing Sheamus first for the Intercontinental title, but Kofi Kingston did not win the battle royale, so Big E. Won the sing the a member of a tag team fatal forward match, which was the winner who we'll face Kane and Big Show for the World Tag Team Titles. That's the reason why they're here tonight. As Ken Kofi Kingston was going to go for a drop kick on Kane, but Big Show caught him. 
Got big. Kane and Big Show has been going for backbreakers almost the entire match. And Big Show! Yo, can you believe that? Stomping on the chest. And Big Show! Back body dropping Kofi. Kofi gets him. Kuzvic. Knocking Big Show down. Co couldn't hold him down long enough for a pin. As he tags in the big man, Big E. Oh my god, a spy buster! Now Big Show go for another backbreaker. <sighs> we want to see new moves, Big Show. As Big Show attacking the skull of Big E. Go for that stomp on the chest. As Big E, how the f no! Military press over his head onto the floor. And now Big Show. Go Big Show. Big E. What a knockdown. Knocking down the Big Show. And again, knocking down the Big Show. Big Show with a STO. Stopping the goal. Oh. Stomping and walking the chest of Big E. And Big Show again to the to the midsection. The leg drop onto the chest. Will that do it? But Kofi realizing. Kofi stopping the count before the count even started. Kofi. Big, Big Show made the tag to Kofi. Kofi got it. Kofi in trouble. Choke slam. Choke slam. What I do it? Choke slam. Big is exhausted. He can't get inside the ring. And Kofi Kingston's eliminated. Biggie has no choice but to get back in the ring. Can Biggie win the titles on his own? But I don't think Biggie could win in this environment. A one on two handicap match. This is a basically a glorified handicap match. Because Kofi Kicks is eliminated. Kofi Kicks didn't do what he did at Survivor Series. Brought out all the fight. Brought out all the fighting spirit. Didn't have it here tonight, I guess. That's Big E. For the Russian leg sweep on Kane. Big Show's exhausted. Big E with a takedown. Biggie gonna go for a cover. No, Kane got right back up. Go for a DDT. Oh no, Biggie counters. Oh, knocking Kane into the corner. Now Biggie bringing Kane. Oh, driven into the post. Making a statement as we speak. That's Biggie trying to fight. Biggie going for a DDT, but Kane. What a counter. Biggie. What's going on there? Just talking trash. And now Kane. And he gets out of the way. Big E walked all the way to, over to Kane. Now Big E going for a clothesline. Knocking Kane down. Gonna attack the skull of Kane. Kane. Big E counters. Again with that military press slam. That won't do it. I doubt it. Oh, the rope break. Biggie trying to fight us all. Like, giving it all as he can. Biggie. Power slam. Hooks the leg. But Big Show was there to stop it. What the Big E go for a cover, but Kane kicks out. How is Big E gonna over try to fight this? He sees it. 
Game. Uh, Biggie with a counter. Just no way. Alright, kick out. Knock Big Show. Take, take it advantage. Look at those eyes. And now Kane calling for it. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, Biggie going for a ride. Chop slam. Okay, being smart. Bringing Biggie into the to the middle of the ring. Cover, hooks the leg. And Kane and Big Show has retained the World Tag Team titles against Biggie. Kofi kicks it for the second time. Here are your winners and still World Tag Team Champions. Kane. Another disappointing match for Kofi Kingston and Big E. But then again, Big Show and Candy Authority always wins. The World Tag Team top Champions will never. Looks like they'll never ever lose those titles. What a successful tag team this, they have been. All right, I think it's time for another tables match here tonight at TLC pay-per-view live at New York City. The following contest is a tables match. The only way to win this bout is to place your opponent through a table. Making his way to the ring from Vancouver, British Columbia, Kevin Owen. Oh, Kevin Owens looking to get revenge. Fight Owens, fight here tonight. Kevin Owens got great tag team members in Bray Wyatt and Christian. But at the end of the day, they they, they lost. Kevin Owens and, and, and his team lost clean to Team Cena. But now Owens wants revenge. Owens looking to get that revenge tonight. Mr. Hustle, loyalty, respect. John Cena is here. Approaching the ring from West Newberry, Massachusetts. Weighing 251 pounds, John Cena. What a superstar. John Cena feels lucky. He feels great. And he's going to go to work on Kevin Owens tonight. Here comes Cena. John Cena. After a victorious win at Survivor Series. A clean win. Against Team Owens. Not tonight. We're going to see Owens in action. Against John Cena. One on one. Live on pay per view. John Cena. Looking ready to go. Here tonight. Who's gonna be put through a table? Cena and Owens. Kevin Owens has Cena, neckbreaker already. John Cena's first one-on-one -on -one match since out in the South as Owens. Dropping Cena, John Cena's first Hell in the South, and first uh, pay-per-view matchup since Hell in the South pay-per-view against Rey Mysterio. Here tonight against Kevin Owens. See that no one's going at it. They're not wasting any time. But Cena better than belly drop. That's John Cena. Just working ahead of Kevin Owens. John Cena with a nice reversal. He's got it. As Owens has seen it all, Cena with a counter.
And Cena with an elbow drop on Owens. Oh, it's whipping Cena into the corner. Cena with a counter. A truck to hold by Owens. Oh, oh, look at this. Wrenching the leg of Cena. Normally that would be a submission hold, but. Oh my god, Owens with a deadlift. German suplex. I mean, gut wrench suplex, sorry. Oh, and Cena with a DDT. And disaster takes advantage. Kevin, the thing, the, the thing between these two is Cena's fighting for his fans, his C Nation, if you will, right? Kevin Owens doesn't give a damn about anybody. He's fighting for himself, for his for his self-respect he's fighting for his pride Kevin Owens at this point is like Vegeta he's trying to fight and his like his pride is in this way of looking at the bright side of things as Owens gonna use the table but Cena As we like to call him Super Cena got taken down by Owens. How much damage did that do? Kevin Owens tweeted, Super Cena, meet Kryptonite. Momentum has shifted back and forth repeatedly between these superstars. And now Cena. Owens counters. Owens set on. A vicious set on. Oh, a super kick! Oh god, John Cena got up. But Owens. Cena go for the shoulder tackle. Here we go. Here comes Cena. John Cena. John Cena is getting this match in gear at this point. Now what's Cena gonna do here? As Owens has Cena. Now oh, it's always gonna go for here. Owens! Oh back! Oh back! I don't know what to call that. His back driven into the the apron of Cena. Now Owens. Going for a DDT, but Cena with a rush of leg sweep. And a knee drop. Now it's Cena gonna go for here. Cena go for a suplex. Oh, leading it off to the table, but the table did not break. If you saw the United States title match earlier, the, the way how Miz did it, Miz put Rey Mysterio in the middle of the table. Cena put him on the, the side of the table, which wouldn't work. You know, Cena. Cena with a drop it on with a counter. Some people don't want to hear it. But the truth is, John Cena is so John Cena back in the ring now. Here comes Owens. As Cena catching him into a DDT. Now Cena gonna go for here. Well, as for the start to John Cena's distinguished WWE career. Oh my god, Owens. Owens has Cena. Owens has Cena. Owens put Cena through a table. Kevin Owens. Here is your winner, Kevin Owens. Has gotten revenge. Gotten his redemption on John Cena. Last month, Team Cena beat Owens. But now, this month, tonight, Owens has beaten John Cena. It's now time for the WWE Championship. The following contest is a tables, ladders, and chairs match. And is for the WWE Championship. 
the edge here. It's time for the WWE title to be on the line. And as Batista makes his way to the ring. Look at the new gear by the WWE Champion. Looks like he's ready for this fight. Against longtime friend, Triple H. Batista, after cashing in that favor, from the authority winning the title against Seth Rollins. Now tonight, Batista has to fight the game. The leader of the of the the authority, the Triple H. Remember, these two members are these two guys competing in tonight in this match are members of the authority. Just saying. But I think that won't be mattered here tonight. I don't think that will matter at all. Tables, ladders, and chairs match for the WWE title. Triple H made it clear a few years ago. When it's the WWE Championship, every man for himself. Oh, look at this. Purple trunks. No beard. Triple H. Trying to look good for a championship match here tonight. Triple H, the king of kings, the CLO, the leader of the authority, the game, the king, uh, the Sergio assassin. Remember, Triple H, the last time he won the WWE title was a hell in the cell in a triple threat hell in the cell matchup. But now, and then he lost the night, he lost it the night after to Chris Jericho. Looks like tonight, tonight might be his rematch. Can Triple H win the WWE Championship and actually hold on to it for a long time? Remember, there's no rematches after tonight. Tonight. The winner faces Seth Rollins at the Royal Rumble pay-per-view for the WWE Championship. So let this guy get this match underway. Here we go. Triple H dropping Batista. Knee in the face of Batista. Remember, TLC match. You gotta take the ladder. And climb, 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 climb all the way to the top to the of the ladder together, to and get together, the title. But unfortunately, That's, that is suspended high above the ring. As Triple H knocking down Batista. There's no reason to be shy about this one. When you see Batista, it's all about a man. for a scoop slam again, but Batista counters. Just look at the name, the Adam. Batista's a genetic freak like no other. And it's back that up time and time again. Yeah, Triple H shots in the head. H just Knocked it down, the WWE champion. He was able to reverse that. Oh, what a close And on. the Triple H with a short clothesline. Short arm clothesline. And now Batista go for a shoulder tackle, but Triple H was still standing. I mean, Whipping Triple H to the, to the corner. Triple H with a counter. Again, whipping him to the corner. Go for a spin in the corner, but Triple H got out the way. You know, Batista's strength 
is like something out of a pages of a comic book. Oh, and a close line. For Batista, it's all about For Batista. Like a lion in the jungle, establishing what's his. The animal's power is dominating and yeah, Triple H. For the reverse counter. He saw that one coming. He's gonna go to the Royal Rumble to fight Seth Rollins for that WWE Championship. As Batista suplex onto Triple H. And Batista's in charge. I know Seth Rollins is watching. He's watching this matchup. As Batista knocking out Triple H. Shots to the head again like to Triple H by Batista. And then having the truck back up and run over you again. His clothesline, his spine buster. Both men were fighting in the ring. Now Triple H realizes it's time to get the ladder. But Batista got it away. And the Triple H knocks down Batista with a clothesline. Putting the ladder down first and then knocks down Batista. And Batista with a re reversal. Go for a backhand chop and a neckbreaker by Batista. Who's going to get that ladder and climb up and get the WWE title? As Batista going for a scoop sign. Maybe a backbreaker. But Triple H with a backbreaker of his own. And again with the knee lift by Batista. Triple H bringing Batista into the ring. Now Triple H going back in the ring. I think he wants to wear down Batista before he can get the ladder. Triple H trying to get the ladder. Batista has the ladder. Triple H going after Batista, but Batista got in the ring. You have to respect the confidence and poise Triple H is showing. And Triple H with a spine buster. I'm not sure if he knows where he is right now. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? And Triple H catching Batista. Didn't go for the pedigree in midair. The game's got him. And that series ends in deadlock. Now it's Triple H gonna go for here. STO. So many historical moments. So many conflicts. So the collision with John Cena. Oh, a shot into the gut. Let's face it, they trained at the same time. Both made their WrestleMania debuts at WrestleMania 20. Both won championships at WrestleMania 21. So this was bound to happen. And Triple H attacking the skull of Batista once again. And Batista going for a better than Betty Suplex. The game avoids trouble there. Yeah, Triple H saw that. And a DDT. The damage has definitely been done. By Batista. Now I mean by Triple H. Onto time. Batista. The and a kick to the gut. Right Batista. Docking down Triple H. They trip. Triple H and Batista has brought in the ladder into the ring, but none of them have set it up yet. Try to take a shot to the back. Right now, massive, nasty clothesline by Batista. He's going to take advantage. Triple H and then Batista knocking down the ladder Watch out to the outside. Now Batista. What the hell is this? And there are no in this match. It's like you know they want each this? other. And this is gonna return to the ring. This isn't now Batista has a ladder. No, not at all. She gonna bring it in? And now he brings in the ladder. Now Triple H sets up the ladder. Triple H climbing, and Batista knocks him down. Now 
And there's the ladder. Oh, and knocking down Triple H. Batista. 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 As the fans are booing. Batista. Batista has the belt. But Triple H not good enough. Batista. Will he retain the WWE Championship? And Triple H knocks down Batista. Onto the side of the ladder. Left Triple H climbing up. Does he have it? No. The ladder's too far back. That's Batista. Batista. Has Triple H going for the Batista Bob. Then he got him. And now Triple H. And a spine bust onto the side of the ladder. But now Triple H. Go for the pedigree. Go for a maneuver. What they need to do is get the ladder. Someone's got to climb up the ladder. As Triple H with a back suplex. Both men are exhausted in, in this matchup. Just Batista, Batista ramming Triple H's head into the ladder. And, and Batista with a knee lift. And a spear countered to a DDT by Triple H. Going for a Batista bomb. Counters. Back suplex once again. If Triple H wants to win the title once again, he got to put the ladder into the middle of the ring so he can climb up and get the belt. But Triple H is trying to wear down Batista. Spy buster. I think Batista's back hit the ladder. But let's do it. Look at this. This could be oh, this is it. He got it this time. With the pedigree. Batista's been hammered on here. And it's showing. And he's busted open. Batista is busted open. And again, the ladder comes into play. Trevor is supposed to beat the hell out of Batista, but Batista does not care. He wants to win the title. He wants to retain the belt. Batista's on top of the ladder. Batista has the belt. Is Batista going to win? And hey, Batista he's retains the title. Batista is facing Seth Rollins for the WWE title at the Royal Rumble in four weeks from tonight. Here is your winner and still WWE Champion representing the authority, the animal, Batista. There should be no doubt in anyone's mind that he is the true and deserving champion. Absolutely. Batista finally wins the matchup. Retains the title. Now it's Batista against Seth Rollins at the Royal Rumble. Seth Rollins must be smiling right now. So he can get his hands on the man that beat him for the title three weeks, three, four weeks ago on Monday Night Raw. Now the celebration begins for the Animal Batista. After being pedigree onto the mat, busted wide open, Batista retains the title. Time for our main event of the TLC pay-per-view. CM Punk, Mr. Best in the World against Edge. It's clobbering time.
CM Punk after retaining the World Heavyweight Championship three weeks ago on SmackDown. Three, four weeks ago on SmackDown. CM Punk retaining the world title in that triple threat match against Ryback and Luke Harper. But after the attack from Bray Wyatt, we're still able to win the matchup. That's why the world title is still around his waist. Winning the world title from Survivor Series from Luke Harper in that last man standing match. Now moving forward, facing Edge in the night. Who will be world champion the next time we come on pay per view at the Royal Rumble? You think Here he comes. The rated R superstar. The Hall of Famer. Edge. The master of the TLC match. Can Edge walk out New York City? And we're not far from Toronto, Ontario, Canada. But all those Canadian friends are watching. Can Edge win the World Heavyweight Championship here tonight? Oh man, I can't wait for this match. And Punk with a suplex off the bat. Edge with a clothesline off the CM Punk. And Punk with a side kick to the side of the head. Oh man. We had first we had two of the most hated superstars. Sure on the roster right now of Monday Night, Night Raw, Triple H and Batista. Now to the most fav fan favorite superstars on SmackDown, Edge and Punk. He's made a career out of capitalizing on others' misfortune. Heck, that's why they call him the ultimate opportunist. Oh, out of nowhere! As Punk with a counter. See a Punk after winning. A battle royale on SmackDown in uh, the month of October in the calendar in Universe mode. Uh, moving forward to Survivor Series. Oh, what's he? What's, yeah, moving forward to Survivor Series, defeating Luke Harper. Moving forward to that triple threat match. Now, facing Edge. He'll tell anybody anything they want to hear, but it helps the winner, the man that Even competed with Team Cena against Team Owens, winning the match, clean sweep, winning the triple threat match the next night on Raw. Well, the winner will face the world champion of their brand at the TLC pay-per-view. That's Punk. And Edge with a flapjack. And Punk is going to go for a maneuver there. And that edge with a punch. Nice reversal there. He's got a nasty looking object in his hands. Watch it. Oh, stop at the last second. And he does it one more time. Now both men at the ladder. I don't think CM Punk even knows what hit him. And Edge with a counter, suplexing Punk onto the floor. They need a ladder. They need a ladder. But Edge is going after a table. Punk is going to go after a ladder. Is he? Edge got the table. Now he has the ladder. 
gets back in. And he gets back in the ring. Oh my! And now Edge dropping Punk DDT onto the floor. You don't want to do this. Onto the mat, I mean. Sorry. You know, I hope to get to see another Edge or Matic here tonight, Oh, God. Uh, oh, like the same move that he beat Punk on SmackDown this past Thursday. Go for the spear, but Punk actually counted it. DDT. As Edge with a flapjack. And now Edge going for a backbreaker. As Punk snap mare into a kick to the back, and then another kick to the back. Go for an elbow. Elbow drop to the leg. Go for a DDT, but Edge counters it. Taking advantage of the situations that are given to him. As Edge with a flapjack once again. No, that's gonna go for here. Go for maneuver, bro. Punk with a counter. Right into the ladder. And now Edge going for a suplex. Both men are exhausted in this match, and so am I. That's why I'm sitting here quietly. I'm a little exhausted. Punk with a DDT. And the ladder is outside the ring. And again, the ladder comes into play. Both on the ladder. And now Edge. Punk is knocked down. Punk is knocked down. Edge has a chance. What is Edge doing? Realizing Punk is getting up. And he's heading back in. And I ain't choose to get back in the ring as Edge has the ladder, but knocks down the ladder. Punk brings Edge into the corner. Now it's Punk thinking here. And it's Edge able to break free. As Punk punts to the corner. Edge. More for a maneuver. But Punk. Oh, go for a maneuver. But Edge with a counter. Now Edge going for a snap. Suplex. He came down on that ladder. <clears throat> What's Puck thinking here? Edge taking advantage of the situations that are given to him. Edge go for a spear and a counter by Punk. Knocking down Edge. No, Edge has the ladder. Setting up the ladder. Go for a GTS. No. Spear and a counter. Go for. A Russian leg sweep by Edge. Edge knocking down the ladder to go for a maneuver. Now he's gonna go for a spear. Here comes Edge. Spear! Spear! Now what? Whipping pocket to the corner. Someone's got to get a ladder, man. It really annoys me when they bring a ladder in the ring. They're going to make the ladder go off the ring right now. Edge with a DDT. Off the punk. I understand you gotta wear down your opponent, but come on. 
and that allowed to go back out the ring. Remember, there are no count outs in this contest. Now Punk getting this a lot of Who's gonna go to the Royal Rumble as World Heavyweight Champion? And both men try to go for an attack as Punk got the advantage. Recording this live now, it's 11 11. As Punk climbing up the ladder. Punk climbing the ladder. Has the world title. What's Edge gonna do here? Knocking down Punk. And there's the reversal. Getting into the corner. Edge gonna go for it now. As Punk knocking down Edge. Why? Punk had the ladder set up. Now Punk is gonna climb up. Edge. Edge is climbing up faster. Ooh. Edge blocks the the the, the paintbrush by Punk. Has the world title. Knocks down Edge. Punk at the title. Is Punk gonna win the Royal Rumble as World Heavyweight Champion? And Punk retains the title. CM Punk. Here is your winner and still world heavyweight champion, CM Punk. How much pain and suffering did he sustain? CM Punk retains the world heavyweight championship. And that's exactly what we saw tonight. What a way to go out. The last pay-per-view of the year. CM Punk will be leaving New York City and the TLC pay-per-view as World Heavyweight Champion. I want to thank everyone for watching here tonight, here today, on Sunday. I want to thank everyone for watching. Good night, everybody. From the TLC pay-per-view. See you for Monday Night Raw coming soon. And also see you for the next pay-per-view, the Royal Rumble. Good night. What a way to end tonight's pay-per-view. I told you guys I'll upload here today on Sunday. My promise has been fulfilled, has been made. What an awesome TLC pay-per-view. Let's go to the results. Let's... All right, from the beginning, Sheamus has defeated Daniel Bryan in a short three-minute match. Jeez. I... Daniel Bryan, disappointing. Rey Mysterio losing to The Miz. United States title has been changed hands. Miz has finally won the U.S. title. Brie Bella retains the title, joining his sister as champion. In the WWE, Kane and Big Show retains the World Tag Team Titles against Big E and Kofi Kingston. Disappointing loss, but I hope they I hope they'll be able to bounce back. Kevin Owens getting revenge on John Cena in this tables match. Batista retaining the title against Triple H and Punk retaining the World Title against Edge. What a way to end tonight's pay per view. So I hope you guys enjoyed this pay per view, this historic night. The last pay-per-view of this universe mode year. We're moving on to the Royal Rumble now. We're almost there to WrestleMania. Only three months away. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Tumblr, all that good shit. Like me on Facebook. The link will be in the description below. Uh, you haven't checked out SmackDown. The link will be also be in the description below. You haven't checked out Raw. The link will be in the description below also. And uh, I want to thank you guys for... Uh, and also, I just want to thank you for watching, and thank you for subscribing, and uh, also share, the, share these videos too, you know, just so it can get more people interested. How about your old buddy, you know? One more thing before I leave is, like this video, and subscribe if you want to see more Universe Mode.
I'm doing the best I can to get a job, make this YouTube channel way better, and I'll be uploading more stuff in the other channel more frequently than ever when I get a job. So stay tuned for that. Stay tuned for more Universe Mode. I'm out, guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all your support. I'm out. Peace.